Welcome back, folks, to Owlboy. It has been some time since I last played, but I still remember somewhat what's going on, or what occurred last time. It has been 20 days since my last session of Owlboy. Greetings, everyone. We have Railder, Death, Top Dog, Daikami Sama, and Chant this morning. Last time, we were in the caves, and of course, everyone had a very large sad because we failed to protect Advent. Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. This Last... is Yagami. <laughs> also, this is Yagami. Last time, we also uh, set up another one of those things. So we are to progress towards there. Ah, yes! We also unleashed Heck. I think that's where I ended it last time. I'm all, I don't want to deal with this. That'll work. It's an interesting mechanic we got here with the swinging lamps. I like how I can prod it with this. Behold, a bird. What are we doing with the bird? I suppose we'll find out soon. Oh. oh, okay. That's one problem I have with this game is it's all... Oh, yeah, you weren't nearly close enough to hit that. Oh. Why are you getting hurt? Why did that go out? Alright, get your ass over here. These damn birds... There we go. Hmm. How am I supposed to go down there without getting just eaten up? There doesn't seem to be much light. Can I somehow... Oh, maybe I can summon another one. Come on, boy. I'm not, I don't think you're affected by spikes or anything, so that's not a concern. Okay, you're gonna die as soon as you go in that water, so it's been nice knowing you. Don't worry, we can make new friends. This music is rather intense. Because, of course, we've unleashed this swarm, this blight on the world. Uh, you can go ahead and go away. I'm gonna go ahead and, whoop, uh oh. Well, that fruit's gone forever. <laughs> Let's get another friend. Come on, you. I was actually going to pick up that thing, and then it got away from me. What the fuck is transpiring down that water? <laughs> Game, if you could bring back the fruit, that'd be real great. Oh. Oh, yeah. I can just pick those things up. Well, that would have been nice to know. That probably would have made everything easier if the game had illustrated that was possible. <laughs> now, I kind of want that fruit that lights up to, you know, come back. That'd be great. I know that's me asking for quite a bit. Also, if this bird could get off my fucking dick so I could eat, that'd also be fine. Yeah, I'm really concerned with that water. Let's see what's over here. Ow. Okay, there's nothing. It just looks like a passageway. Hey, Vic. Let's see, who else has dropped in the uh, chat? We have Swystein here this morning. E Evan himself. Uh, greetings from Germany. Well, I only have one thing to say about that, uh, Swystein. Verdammter Scheiße. <laughs> Alan and mine, mine's favorite new uh, phrase. Well, you're fucking... Maybe I just need to actually pick you up. Ow, 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 ow. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Don't die. Okay, I'm obviously supposed to pick that guy up. Come here, you. Ah, okay. So I can die when I'm holding those. I did that for science as well. Hmm. 
Oh, great, we get to do it all over again. Well, that's fucking fantastic. <laughs> I think it's one of our first deaths in this game, to be honest. I think the fruit is still pickable. Oh, maybe that's what all the splashing around was. It was a very active fruit. <laughs> of course. How could I have been so blind? <laughs> okay, well, we'll fly through here. It's not going to be an issue. And since we know, you know, what we need to do with you, we'll just slam dunk your ass right there, pick up our friend. And this bird will go ahead and lead us to greatness. Come on. Come on, bird. Alright, well, let's you go ahead and have your moment. Alright, let's go ahead and throw you. Let's pick up this and consume it. And that'll be much... That'll make things much, much easier. We'll go and get rid of you. I have my own life for a little bit here. I have nothing there. Why is there a string there? What does it mean? These fucking dark levels. Okay, here's a place. Oof. Well, that was unfortunate. Doubly unfortunate. I gotta remember my controls. Come on. Ah, fucking god damn it. I just want... I just... Pick it. Pick it up. Thank you. Fucking god damn it. Fucking Christ, there's so much shit flying around. Hopefully this gives me a little bit of life. Okay, it did give me just the smallest amount. Oh wait, I can actually eat more. Out of the way, you. Pick it up, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Otis. We gotta give the fruit some room to grow. Nice of the devs to let this just heal me up right here. Very good. Alright, come with me, you. Oh, of course, there's more fruits. I believe this was actually down where this thing was. No, that's a different area. Ah, here we go. Okay, you sit here to the side. I can actually grab that thing? Well, shit, that makes it easier. <laughs> but where the fun be in that, not just, you know, beating it around the bush? Okay. <laughs> Very good. think we can actually get out of here now. It's true. These dark areas are always a pain in the dick, and it's a wonder why anyone makes them. Okay, I think this is the way to progress, perhaps. There's those little bastards. Go fuck yourself. Watch out for dragons. Goddamn Pokemons. This may, in fact, be not the right way, but we're going to try it anyway. Excuse me, pardon me. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> nice that we can knock that guy through there. Okay, good. It was the right way. How about that? Even after almost three weeks, I can kind of remember my way around. Let's see. Stereotypical of games of these types. Yep. There's some really brilliant examples. Yeah, it's true. Most of, the, most of them are bad. Few of them are good. What the fuck is this? <laughs> a 
I'll tell you what it is. It's tedious as fuck. Because I gotta wait for him to charge back up to do this, or I can wait for... I gotta remember who our cast is called, Getty, to actually... kill him, and it takes a long time for Getty to kill these things. Too long. What's this? I like how it gave me no time. You need to give me like some cartoonish falling action there, game. Where it just takes a little while for the inertia to set in. Perfect. Just as intended. I knew it was down there. Good price for all that work, I know. Hmm. Seems like a safe place to be. Oh, good. Some fruits off in the distance growing inside this apparent volcano, or at least other magma-filled chamber. As you know, fruits often do. Fruits and root vegetables. I gotta remember voices. Let's see. You're Australian, right? That's right. Alphonse. Ha 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 ha! So, thought you could wheeze yourself back into the pirates, huh? <laughs> You've even brought friends. An owl, no less. Funny how quickly you can change sides. Let's see how well he can fly after I've cut his wings off. He catches that thing by the tip of its blade. <laughs> Okay, I remember Getty's voice, because he had the Krillin voice. Hey! You're not ruffling a single feather on Otis, or... Or... Or you'll be sorry! <laughs> Look at this guy! It sir uh, greens a lot! You! It's your fault! All of Advent! All of this? Heh, <laughs> maybe you should have stayed at your post in Valley. Right, Dirk? Sharp Twig, you're as much of a loser as they are. Huh? Are we gonna get new friends? Are it gonna be this Twig guy? Heh, <laughs> <laughs> don't worry, Goggles. I'm not going to hurt you. Not when I have someone to do that for me. Someone. Oh. What the fuck is that? Huh? Wait. Oh, now you've done it. Oops. Looks like I woke it up. Dirk, what are you doing? It's been fun, Twig. But we don't need you anymore. What? Now? Thing is just pulsating and undulating up there. Everyone teleports out except for Otis because he can't. What am I looking at here? Zzz. Boot sequence initiated. Directive protect the hex machine. Destroy all interloping agents. I see that it has some sort of screw mechanism on its head, or at least what can be inferred as a head. Oh my goodness! Sir, I'm gonna need you to stop jumping around, if you would. <laughs> okay, well that works too, I suppose. <laughs> so what you're saying is I have no room to move around. Gotcha. Okay, maybe I can just shoot your ass. Okay, here we go with this again. Oops. Let me go ahead and just preemptively get hit. That'll save everyone a lot of time, right? Okay, there's a safe sp space up there, but executing it is not as easy as it could be. Okay, I've knocked off the thing. Oof. Oh, he picked it back up. Let's 
So far, this is proving to be extremely difficult, actually. Huh. I guess he always jumps to the right first. That's good to know. So you're saying I should always be on this side. Yeah, there it goes. Okay, that's not so bad once you know that. Okay, blew that up. Oof. And then he fucking slapped my ass. Oh, goodness. <laughs> so what you're saying is I done goofed. Oh, he is very upset. And now these things aren't going away as quickly. So that's unfortunate. Oh, he is not fucking happy with the situation, as you might expect. Ugh. I'm gonna have to find out that pattern. Ugh. Getting too aggressive now. Yeah, I'm gonna get fucked. Yep. So I didn't instantly... Or did I win? What is transpiring here? <laughs> Lethal tilts his head quizzically. I don't know if we succeed. <laughs> Or if it actually took it easy on me after I got the zero health. You, don't move or I'll, I'll shoot. Damn, please don't shoot dots. Uh, hey! I only had a very small sliver left. I did see that. But I thought, <laughs> I mean, that was a hell of a last second save if that's really what happened. Oh man, he got away. Why does this keep happening? Hmm, that spider person. He does not seem particularly malicious. If I were to guess, I'd say that he does not know what trouble he is in. Dirk, however, my former comrade, he trapped us in here with that thing. In blue text. The next time we meet him, I fear that we might have to. But no matter. Let's just find a way out of here. Okay. Wait, now I can teleport? Hmm. This is when I die and have to do that entire sequence again. Hmm. Whoa! Otis, did you get just get teleported? I guess now we all know how it feels. Although we lost track of Dirk. At this rate, he'll get to the final relic before we can. Maybe not, Mr. Giddy. The doors in that floating con act as a defense gate. He'll surely be trapped in there until we can figure a way to open them. Reactivating this teleporter would surely bring us back to that room. If memory serves, there should be a way to reactivate it around here. Oh, okay, alright. Still, let's hurry and try to find a way before back before Dirk reaches that relic. Okay. 
Also, one thing I didn't mention last time is we found out that the Owls created the Pirates. They were supposed to be some sort of servitor machine race or something to that effect. <laughs> okay, a wait <laughs> emerges from the shadows to greet us as we enter this new place. The fuck am I looking at? <laughs> Just turned into a little owl thing. Alright, release it. Thank you. I think I see Buccaneary's shop up there. Oh, wait. I think we've been this area before. Y'all got any of them, uh, those healths? <laughs> he just fucking whaps my ass in the back of the head and I die. Good work, Lethal. All you had to do was get away from him. Don't worry. That was all of a brilliant scheme to get all my health back. Wink. Which I did, as you can plainly see. Alright, back to your shop. Anything in the thing? Let's see, we're missing a lot. In fact, the floating continent jungle, we're missing almost half of the stuffs. I know, nothing like a good death to heal you up. Welcome! Let's tally up that booty. You've collected 1149 Buccaneery coins. Well, well, well. You're becoming quite the adventurer. I think you're worthy of a, this next surprise. For high flying adventurers, o adventurers only. Behold! Hooray! I have a hat. I can see that. Will you please bring it to the nice owl person? But. No buts! It's yours, sir. <laughs> I'll just toss out that ugly green hat then. Oh my, such a hoot style. A hoot style? Huh, it's, it's a little big. But it does look pretty awesome. I miss it already. Well, that's great. Back to your shack now. Okay, ma'am. Rolls off into the distance. How much do we need for this? Oh, just a few more. Increases your health. Wow. An attached blaster unit for more range. Question marks. Fire drive. For maximum fire and the specter cloak, which requires a question mark amount of coins. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here. No, not you. Your friends tend to get in the way in this game. That's right, death to save time. Hey, what y'all doing up here? You're that badass from last time. I guess it's time to, <laughs> time to try and turn over a new leaf and plan ahead. Can't grieve forever. Bonanza is away gathering supplies for us. I have to keep myself fed and try to figure out what to do next. One step at a time. Yeah, you were like a badass who was beating stuff with your uh, with your cane. It's a shame your leg's still fucked up, it looks like. Oh, let's grab that, let's grab that. All these matter. Get some free stuff there. Probably be back to that place. Oh yeah, that's what it was. Also, how the heck did I zoom around? I remember zooming. Guess I'll pull up this thing. Alright, that thing's working again. Good, good. What's over here? Whoa! Okay, we still need some stuff and things for that. 
There's some manner of ring on the other side. Hey there, guys. What are you doing? Hey, bud. I think you say the same thing. Hey, hey, bud. Yep. Those little rascals. Alright, where was that thing I was just at? It's not up here, is it? No, it's the old owl temple. This game could really use a map, and maybe it has one. I don't know where it is, though. Here we go. Let us return. And I could be extremely dignified if I got that cloak. Okay, guys, it seems there's more to this place than a blob monster that just <laughs> is apparently an ancient machine. There's no telling what we'll encounter next. Not to worry, Mr. Giddy. We've had some great progress. Isn't that right, Mr. Otis? You know he can't talk. <laughs> I think he's in teleporter coma. <laughs> I'm not so sure about that. Uh, hey, buddy. I'm go it's going to be okay, man. I'm always going to be there for you, no matter what. Okay. Now let's go! This place is nothing for the likes of us. Okay. Alright, so we've arrived at Norfair. In fact, the music does remind me a bit of, like, Super Metroid. It's a shame it immediately turned off as I entered the next room. Hey, what? You again? I don't know how you got past the defense system, but there's no way that you're going to... You're getting this relic before me. It's right here, it's mine. And then he just zips off to off. Okay. What's in there? Pretty good. What's over here? Okay, something we can't get through yet. Oh, or maybe we can. What is this? Oh my, I recognize this language. It appears to be Cubasic. It was written by an ancient owl. Let me read it for you. Clearing out this continent has taken a while. But we can finally begin our work. The work from the abandoned temple has paid off. And we have been able to make the local wildlife part of the theorem solver. We'll augment them and make them <laughs> excavate with, uh, with automatons. Which are also as pirates in case you forgot. Also nice hat there, Otis. I estimate that within a few decades of excavation, we can begin construction. And that's where it ends. Fantastic. Hmm. Interesting. Oof. <laughs> it just shoots a very small, like, ping pong ball at me and knocks me down. Hmm. Can I, like, knock these back? I almost feel like I should be able to. Hmm. Also, they shoot through terrain. That's fucking bullshit. <laughs> Why don't my bullets go through terrain, Mom? Alright, let's see where he went. Oh, he went through, of course, a thing. What was that noise about? Why did it make a noise? Okay, well, we're supposed to go through here anyway, which means I need to figure out how to somehow get around you. Maybe I just need to... Okay, so it was much easier than I fucking made it out to be. All I had to do was whap you. Also, I could get more health. That sounds like a crutch. 
No. Let me wait for <laughs> the refactory period of this damn pirate. Oh, that looks good. That looks like instant death there. My favorite. All right. Let's get ready for this. Okay, that wasn't too bad. They have a health thing on the other side, so, so maybe it is an instant death. Hey, it's one of you little rascals. I haven't seen you for a while. I'm just going to ignore you. We don't need to play with you, right? We need to play with you. Oh. Now I gotta wait for that again. What is this little novel here for? Do you yield secrets? We shall see in just a moment. No, you're just there being a knob. There's more of these damn things around. The way they meander about is pretty pretty adorable, actually. There's probably a faster way to take these guys out, but I'm not I can't remember what it is if there is. Ah, maybe that's what it was. Maybe after I clear out the room, it makes that noise. Another little novel that doesn't actually do anything. Was it even me? No map, the levels are not that complicated. I suppose not. I was gonna be cute. <laughs> and you said, no being cute. Okay, this one at least appears to serve a purpose. Since you can make it easier on yourself by just blowing it away. Oh, hey there. Manners. All right, more of this. At least we get to enjoy the music again. All right, we're going to have another info dump, huh? There's been some infighting and some of the main architects have left the project. They have been banished from the continent, and the work continues. The Light Cradle is operational, and we have all the power that we need. Construction of the Hex Machine itself has been delayed due to immense com the immense complexity of the structure. I hope I will see construction begin in my lifetime. Interesting. All right. <laughs> Don't question that we can screw this gigantic thing just by turning around. <laughs> I think so there, Daikami-sama. I like the atmosphere of this game. They have put a lot of love into it. What have we released this time? Is it the <laughs> more terrible bugs? Ah, that's why I thought I was all... We're going to be around the other side of this thing. Still in there pretty good. Tedium. Alright, let's keep you out. Wait for you to get that period done. Come on, let's go. Go, 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 go. Now we got monkeys. We had monkeys. <laughs> you killed him. Oh my goodness. Oh, shit. They go through terrain. I can't go through that, can I? Oh, no, it's it's something I can. Silly monkeys. This is a fun little enemy type. Noisy enemy type, though. It's over here. Okay, that's another door, he said, with air quotes. Uh, 
Well, I can go ahead and get some extra health, I guess. It's an interesting mechanic that you can overheal. Silly monkeys. Oh, you're lucky I haven't charged up yet. Ha! Huh, took two of them out. Oh. Bad monkeys. No! Oh, shit, dog. I suppose that would make sense that if you fell in lava, you'd instantly fucking die. But. But. Still not happy with the circumstances. So about that extra health I got, that was real handy. Listen here, you little shit. Okay, so I can't just... Oh, good, you ran into it. Like an idiot. Uh oh. He's coming to get me. Listen. He's actually trying to throw that at him, but whatever. You little fucking dicks. Oh, I'm stuck. These leaves have impeded my progress. Oh, shit. Lethal has gotten really rusty at this game, it would seem. Terribly rusty. Alright. Let's see if we can go through here without getting just, just absolutely destroyed. Okay, so you don't get destroyed that way. No! <laughs> you idiot! Can't believe you fell in the lava. Who even does that shit? Very disappointing. Alright. Well, we got some coinage. That'll save America. Anyone who tells you otherwise, well... Does not want to save America. <laughs> We're not going to comment on this room? Alphonse, you don't have anything to say about this room that is covered with computers in some sort of Matrix-like fashion. <laughs> okay. Sure, whatever. <laughs> Another room full of monkeys. You know what? Let's see what's on the other side of this. Oh, it's a door. Sorry, it looked like the background. <laughs> they belong in funny videos. Not here, damn it. Listen. I would advise against aggressing towards me. Why are there more of you? But wait, there's more. Call now, get additional. Oh! Get additional fucking jumping monkeys for absolutely free. Lex Machine is, begin is beginning to take shape. I'm not sure anyone fully understands the design anymore, but the initial tests have been successful. The Lake Cradle is over capacity and we are drawing power from the continent itself. We'll fire up the X machine within a few years when the relics ha are charged. I wish my father could have been here to see this. Thank you. Alright, you can go ahead and sit there, I'm gonna eat. I heard you before you fucking pounced on my face, that's kind of bullshit game. What's this? Oh my goodness. Listen, you being dicks. It's not appropriate. Okay, I have a feeling I need to bring this down here. To the room with all the things. You go here, right? Ah! Alright. Well, now that that's screwed... You can jump there for all eternity. I don't give a shit! Holy fuck! I'm gonna die. There's a fruit. Uh oh. Mine! Mine, 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 mine. Lethal's in a pickle. Let's dissect the situation. <laughs> like how my gun is kind of bouncing there as I track them. Triple multi kill! You idiot! 
Oh, I hear you. Making your noises. Make those noises in hell, boy! I'm gonna take these rings and leave you in peace. I'm gonna say we could have been friends! <sighs> Too many fucking monkeys. What? <laughs> oh, that was pretty fucking cool! <laughs> Yes, I'm very proud of your success, too. You fucking idiot. <laughs> oh, shit. Alright, go over there so I can activate this. Mm. It's a disaster, it's a disaster, it's a disaster, it's a disaster. Disaster stunts. It goes on like that for quite a while. Eat. Go, 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 go. Oh, I was hoping I could... Uh oh. He's on fire from downtown. What? Oh. The way you're facing actually does matter here. Doings are transpiring. You know, I should probably... Now that I've done this, and this is probably a checkpoint, what I should do is drop my friends in the lava and see what happens. Although, maybe the lava has all receded at this point. Are you gonna open? Thank you. Do, 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 do. I wonder if I could have always gone there. Almost certainly, right? <clears throat> Alright, now you're interested. How curious. These displays are showing some schematics along with the log. It says... The hex is complete. The world is destroyed. Looping. The, 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 the world is destroyed? What does that mean? Hmm. The hex is complete. The world is destroyed. Looping. Well, the world is definitely still out there. I wonder what the elves were doing in here. Sounds like well, the work of madness. I don't want to stay in a place, this place any longer than we have to. Let's just get this relic before Dirk does and get out of here. Let's see what's on the other side here, since we just opened this up. Get some free health. Oh. Why did we jump down into this? Oh, he is upsetty as fuck. <laughs> He's got four arms, too. Get fucked. Rawr, rawr, rawr. He has little arms in back there, like, up on the ceiling. Not really up on the ceiling, but you know what I mean, kind of. Oh, this. Oh! Wow. I didn't realize there'd be instant death down there all time. All the fucking time. That is really fucking rude. <laughs> Holy shit. Yes, we can go ahead and skip this. We've seen him poke him before. Wait. I understand. There's... Okay, the... Oh! They... Okay, so what happens is they fucking tear your ass down into the lava. Also, I'm standing on something right here. I don't understand. Well, this is a rather abusive room in comparison to the other ones. Well, if I play my cards right, I can probably actually kill these things pretty quick. 
If they're on the edges of the room. Two for one. Yeah, see, like that one right there, I just dropped him right into the lava. But wait, there's more. Call now and get additional fucking monkeys for absolutely free. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I can tell you I'm pretty, pretty ready for this to fucking end. Something's got you spooked. <laughs> we put the gun to the back of his head. <laughs> Just kidding. We'll let you live for another day. Game does a great job of directing you to the path of progress as these things flip up like, I don't know, shooting targets? Alright, we've reached this area. So can we just pick this up now? Not quite yet. There's still more to do down here. Whoa, don't slide off. I feel like screwing this thing in is probably not a great idea. We're gonna do it anyway. Oh boy. Oh my goodness! <laughs> oh my fucking goodness! Remembering a land for the Super Nintendo- Oh Christ! What? Whatever. Ain't no one got time for your- Oh God. <sighs> Shitty monkeys. The hitbox on those monkeys is actually much larger than their sprite it feels like. Because that one was not touching me at all. I had not come into the contact with the monkey just yet. Jump, you fool! <laughs> Fuck. Get up! Fucking shitty monkeys! Fucking suicidal bastards! They do a great job of building up the fucking urgency in that scene. Otis, are you alright? We need to find a way out of here. I think we're in over our heads. I don't think you're wrong. <laughs> Let's look for an exit, Otis. Okay. Uh, is that lava coming out of there, Dots? <laughs> is the ground shaking? Let's get out of here before it's too late! Oh, man! That sounds like the music for the bugs. Oh, my goodness! It just barked at me and I fell down. Wow, there's a lot of shit going on now. Of course, it was one of those arcing paths. I should have known from from all the Metroid games. Fuck. <laughs> Wasn't even sure he'd take damage from that, to be honest. Man, there's a lot of awesome sprite work just flying across the screen. Didn't think I was that close, but apparently I was.
Fuck, oh, damn it. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yep, I wasn't getting away from that. If lethal gets out of this one, it's gonna be another fucking close shave. Coming out of the ground to do this again. <sighs> okay, he's going to swoop from that. Yep. I didn't do a great shot there. Yeah, I wasn't getting out of that one. Damn, I wasn't gonna try though. Sir, if you could consider dying, I know you're some sort of, some ancient, I don't know, machine worm that lives here in the comfort of his own lava cave. But uh, if you could become deceased. <laughs> no, not headbutt me, that's different. That's even worse. Lethal getting overly aggressive, it's costing him. Lethal is regretting not getting the extra health. <laughs> Think that would have probably saved Christmas here. Oh my goodness, I thought you were rearing up. You were not in fact rearing up. Okay, here's the point that matters. Almost got headbutt. I guess I'm expecting more forgiving hitboxes. Sorry for my lack of skill, folks. Let's do it all over again. <laughs> but now we know the patterns. So now there's not going to be an issue, right? Oh. I think if I stay up top, he has the most predictable pattern here. Yep, and then he rears up. I shoot him in the face, I move back. Gotta just go up into the corner for this move. I think that's the safest spot. Wait for him to do that. Shoot him in the back of the head with that. Oh, there he is. I was all, where the fuck is he? Okay, that's that one. Okay, he's rearing up. Top corner lethal, there you go. I was gonna say, let's go for a flawless victory, then he fucking just backed up into me. Oh, there he goes from the ceiling again. Oh, this fight. All right, here he goes, rearing up again. Sir, maybe it has not occurred to you, but you have too much health to be healthy. I know you were saying, you're saying that's an oxymoron, Lee. Well, you can't be too healthy to be healthy. No, I mean for my health. I'm still impressed with just the fluidity of the sprite work in here. Like, the animations are really spectacular. Oh, he's coming from the ceiling again, as you do. So I'm sorry I can't reach out right now. You understand that's something taking my focus.
Really, once you know most of his attack patterns, it's not that bad. That initial thing with this thing just squirreling around the screen. Willy nilly. Oh, I was trying to get some sweet moves there. Oh my goodness. Sir, you appear to have something on your head. Oh. We're going into a second phase? Alright, you little teapot. No, oh, apparently I'm latching onto it in a plot sequence. Okay. <laughs> sure, we're gonna ride the worm. If Ellen is here, we could ride the snake. <laughs> what? Can I actually... I can. Oh, okay. So I'm not exactly sure what my, what I'm trying to do here. Am I trying to escape? Am I trying to hurt this thing? I think I'm just trying to survive. So I press up to go up, and it's the same directions as I go through here. Okay, so yeah, so it's just survival there. Lava on the ceiling. Always good. We're not done yet. Hell of an epic adventure we have here is we ride the snake. Uh oh. Felt my wings on that one. Oh, fuck. Oof. Oh, grab on, man! Oh, grab on, man! Thought that was Getty. This Twig character has pulled us free of the snake. Reminds me of some movie scenes, I know, right? I think he's gone. We should probably go check it out. Okay. I gotta say, the difficulty of this game has ramped up significantly. <laughs> well, this is nice. Hey, wait up! Had to see who it was first. That was a close call, huh, guys? But we did it! We are a great team! Team? You helped the pirates atta attack Valley! You were still on their you were still on their side during the attack on Advent! You tried to get us killed in the floating continent! And you think we're on you're on our team? I'm 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 sorry. I, I didn't realize what the pirates are up to. I just wanted someone to hang out with. <laughs> we don't want your company. We have enough people for Otis to actually switch between, between at this moment. We don't want anything to do with you. Isn't that right, guys? Guys? Alas! I am hardly one to berate anyone following the pirates. I cooperate, cooperate with them in the attack on Veli together with Dirk. And I am a pirate myself. Are you serious? That's not the same at all. Otis? Sue yourselves. But I don't have to put up with this. I'm... I'm going back to Valley. Is, is he gone? Ah, oh, man, I didn't mean to cause any trouble. I think I'll go home now. Okay, so you caused all the trouble and then you just went home. You fucking dick. Hmm, well. 
Do not worry, Master Otis. Goody will come around. Meanwhile, let's try to find a way out of here. All right, so it's just us and our friend Alphonse. Oh, he's over here being sad. <laughs> oh, um, hi. Do you think I could, like, help? You could help me a bit over here? I can't get past this ice wall. Okay. There you go. Thanks. Aha! And thus his mechanic will be shown, I'm sure. We can't get past this horrible wind. Hey, you need some help over there? Uh -huh. Listen, if you help me get back home, I'll help you get out of here. I'll let you pick me up, but be careful not to tear my get up, or, uh, oh, will ya? Your get up. Alright. Okay, so I can't go all the way over there. Come back. <laughs> I can shot web. Holy shit. That's kind of cool. Also, it doesn't look like your arm, really. It looks kind of weird. I guess I'll, I guess I'll accept it. You go ahead and sit there. What's this? What, what is that? <laughs> oh, whatever. Just an indication that I can shot web in that direction? Spooderman! I do like this mechanic. This is pretty fun. So, by tapping, I can shoot the little balls. And if I hold, then I can actually do this. Oh, I can uh, bring them to me, too. Oh, that's kind of nice, too. Hmm. Almost looks like an invisible wall. The ice shattering animation is delicious. Simply delicious. Alright, I think I can make my way home from here. Thanks for the ride, fellas. The ride? I guess I did carry you around a bit. Hey, Alphonse, you got nothing to say about this? Nice landscape here. The snow falling up. What the? Oh. Fantastic. So yeah, it's just us and all the so I can't bring back Twig or whatever his name was. There's a critter in there. Let's leave him there. More critters. Aha! There's one of those eye bats, those gawks, I think that is what they were called. I know, this is pretty moody today. today. All kinds of ambiance. Oh, that was the shell. <laughs> the shell casing. So what the fuck is that? I can't go up there. I guess I'll go this way. Wait. Mom, you got any frozen, like, parsnips or anything over here? The pirates flying in the background? Oh, hey. Shh. It's my family. They're in trouble. What? You got a family? Let's see. Do I have any particular voice for you? I don't think I did. Maybe I'll just make you generic pirates or something. Our inspection is over for today. Don't try anything stupid if you value your lives. We won't cause any trouble. Good, as long as you don't cause any trouble, the occupation will be over before you know it. We'll be back tomorrow. Let's go, Mr. 
destroyed half of our furniture. Let's see, I'm not exactly sure what this creature is supposed to be. At least we d they didn't find the wine cellar. Well, let's get back inside before they come back. It's too damn cold from the, these old bones. Ah, oh, man, I didn't think the pirates would cause trouble with my for my family. I better go check on them. Uh -huh. Hmm. Why are there pirates around here? We should investigate this area, but I don't like this, Otis. If we proceed, uh, we need to be very, very careful. I shall stay out of sight for now. Okay. Also, we completely forgot about that relic we left behind. Okay, so that's his paw, the old one, and his bro. Okay, cool. Hi, pa. Hi, hi, bro. I'm home. Ah, Twig. Is that you over there? So it is. And you brought home a friend. You still hanging out with those pirate friends then? Twig hasn't brought a pirate home into this house now. <laughs> Hasn't brought a pirate into... Okay, I guess he's... He hasn't brought a pirate into this house now, has he? This is Otis. He's an owl. From Va from Valley. I wanted to check... You're still pretending to be a... Oh, actually, this is the brother. You're still pretending to be a spider, are you? You see, Otis from Valley, Twig here has always been sort of a weirdo. Dressing up as a spider because it's cooler than being a stick bug. I see. But how does he shot web if he's not a spider? It is cooler. Enough, Twig. I guess that's why his name is Twig, because he's a stick bug. <sighs> anyway. Get out of that costume and let's talk. Pa, please, not in front of my friend. You're embarrassing me. Just do it, Twig. Sigh. He does look much different now. There. Are you happy now? Great. We just want to ask a few questions without you looking like an idiot. So, are you home to stay this time? Or are you still in league with those insistent pirates? The pirates ditched me. They were just using me for my web shotting abilities. And this guest here, is he a delinquent like you? Otis is a good guy, bro. He just wants to find his way back home. Hmm, well then. Make yourself at home, Otis. I apologize for the rude welcome. We can be never be too sure these days. Do careful, rather. Welcome to the Stick family home. Okay, let's talk to all of you. I hope Twig hasn't caused you too much trouble. Twig's always been a, a special case. I'm glad, glad some good friends turned up for him. Maybe you can recommend that Twig stay in Mesos and leave you alone. I can hear you. I'm in the same room. I wish Twig would just quit the spider act and stay at home like a normal stick bug. How did you end up with Twig anyway? Twig's always been a troublemaker, driving everyone nuts with worry. Don't tell us Twig's... Don't... Tell Twig I said that. The truth hurts the sensitive. Oh, you can't speak at all. I guess that takes care of that problem. What are you whispering about over there? Nothing important, I'm sure. Alright, so you have anything else? Oh, and try to tell St uh, Twig not to dress up in that silly costume. Not to sound old-fashioned, but it does shame our entire family. I can still hear you, Dad. 
I was actually going to talk to the brother, but whatever. Between you and me, Otis, joking aside, I understand why Twig would want to leave. Every day, he is colder than the last. You know, we're living in the Frostpunk universe over here in Mezos. And there isn't much company here except for Roland and me. There's really only two people in this entire place? <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? I just want it. I just want to know that Twig stays out of trouble and comes back home one day. All right, let's talk to you. We might look upper class to you, but times in Mezzos are tough. You, you do? You do look upper class? I suppose you must. There used to be rolling green hills here. Now it's all frozen wasteland. All the more reason for Twig to stay home and stop these silly adventures. We could certainly use every helping hand we have around here, and, you know, we have a lot of hands. Okay, you're saying the same thing. Let's get the fuck out of here. You got anything to say? As you can see, they were right. I'm a stick bug just like them. So boring. At least I can be a spider when I'm not in here. Well, I can hang out with you guys. The way I don't have to be at home. Let me know when you're leaving so I can put on my shoot again. Anything else? Okay. Same thing. Let's get the fuck out of here. Hey, wait up. I'll come with you. Just let me put on my threads. Something something spider bands. Well, that was fun. I wonder why my family was happy to see me at all. Surely they must have been somewhat worried. Especially in blue text, when there seems to be pirates around. See, there's one right there. And there's another one. I doubt it. Every time I come home, they just go on about how what a freak I am. Would you, like, mind if... I hang out with you guys for a while. Well, until, you know, you find a way out of here. As it stands, Getty is yet to return. And we could always use your unique abilities. Would you say, Otis? Huh? Really? You'll let me join? Thank you. I'll help you in any way I can. Okay. <laughs> the last time we'll get to see that flipping animation. A prankster and a troublemaker who likes to dress up as a spider. Twig shots web pellets and can that can slow down and tangle enemies. He can also grab both walls and objects. Cool. Let's go back here. We, of course, had some stuff we could possibly get. Okay, so it does sort of target those. Although you don't need them. You can definitely not use those, which is an interesting design choice. Can I pull that right out of the wall? That'd be something. You missed it. You freak. All you have to do is hit it. It's interesting the way this blowing snow works, because it doesn't immediately hurt you. You have to stay in it for just long enough for it to acknowledge your presence, and then it gets angry and kills you. This must be some sort of pirate stronghold. Oh dear. So the pirates have set up their base here. Pirate base? But... It's like right next door to my family's house. Indeed. This doesn't bode well. Perhaps Dirk, 
acquire the final relic before the dungeon flooded? Well, I didn't, if he did, we didn't see him there, and I'm pretty sure we flew past it on the way up. Looks like there's no way in. And even if there was, we'd be discovered immediately. We have to warn your family, Twig. If the pirate base is here, the occupation will only get worse. I can't believe I was suckered into working for these guys. I wonder, no wonder my dad was suspicious of me. Let's go warn them. Okay. Do 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 Oh, aha! Bro, Pa, the pirates! They've made their base up here in Mezos! Old fucking man dots! Yeah, we know that, Twig. It's worrisome, but we just have to accept it. But you have to evacuate! No, Twig. This is our home. We won't evacuate just because there are some pirates nearby. But please, you don't, you don't understand. No! We cannot let fear dictate our actions. It seems I have to make you understand. And now he fights us. <laughs> let me show you up close how an adult stares death in the eye, gives him the old stink eye. Just one moment. I'm coming. Just give me a second here. Pirates, huh? I'll give you a power, you son of a... There you are, Twig. Now, if you see a pirate... A pi 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 pirates! What's that? Speak up, sir. Big pirate right on your fucking face. <laughs> see cover! Inconceivable treachery, blimey crud! Unheard of delinquent evil do a monstrosity inconceivable. Okay, he's going on. No, no. We just, why? We just want to talk. Are uh, are you a the pirate leader? Um. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Um. I have come bearing news of our operation here in Mezos. We are, um, we are planning to, er, uh, we are planning to build our sprawling citadel right here. Mezos will be the epicenter of our new rule, rich in wealth and any all manner of luxury. And we need t Twig here for, uh, for, um, Drawing a blink your duts. A cooking? Cooking? Twig. There's no need to play games. If you want to leave with these friends of yours, you are free to do so. We may not like it, but we'll support you. He's become a little like Alphonse, it seems. As far as the voice is concerned. But don't forget that this is your home. And we'll be here when you return. Is there anything we can do, we can help you with, Twig? Well, we need to get into the pirate base for undisclosed reasons. Maybe to find the relic or somewhat. All right. There is a passage hidden beneath the waterfall in Tropos that might be able to help you. Might take you there. You couldn't get there before because, of course, they didn't have your web-slinging abilities. But now they do. 
You might not remember, but sometimes we used it as kids. I can take you to Strato if you'd like. Thanks, bro. Sorry for trying to trick you guys. Don't worry. It would take more than a prank of yours to pull your paw. <laughs> well, anyway, now be on your way. If you have something to, if you have something important to do, don't you? Do you want to go to Tropos straight away? Uh, not yet. <laughs> I'd like to actually look around a little bit more. All right, tell me if you need any help. I will. I didn't really look over here to the right. There could be things and stuff. You know I love things. Oh. I, I suppose you would know the pirate base is right next door, considering there is this right here. <laughs> oh, well. I guess I'm done. You may take me to Tropos now. Yes, let's go ahead and go to Strato. All right, follow me. <laughs> Lethal squints at screen. That was there the whole time? Oh boy. He did get the final relic. Well, hot shit. I guess we're fucking doomed. I'm actually going to rewatch that segment where we were abating the lava. See if it's still there. Well, here we are. You'll find your way to Tropos from here. Remember, you will find the hidden entrance to the pirate base behind the waterfall in Tropos. By the way, Twig, did you by chance notice any tremors on your way up here? Oh yeah, there, that was us. Alice's his friends woke up a giant snake monster. And I had to come to save him. What? Did anyone get hurt? Are you okay? Don't worry, bro. We're pretty tough. <sighs> Just try not to get in any trouble, okay? You know, Pa and I... Pa doesn't matter. Just be careful out there, will you? Come back home from time to time and call and send a letter or two, maybe. Take care in this passage as well. It's not been long since... It's been long since I last used it. Might be monsters about, of all things. Okay. Don't get in any tr more trouble, or I'll tell Pa, okay? Okay. All right. Let's have some fun! Okay. Hmm, what is that? Is that edible? It is. Some kind of ice fruit. Go ahead and light those for no particular reason. That's a door right there. Ow! Fucking dick. Piece of trash. So what you get? Oh, I can eat that. I do like how I can just instantly make you guys not a problem anymore. That's pretty handy. What? That's pretty cool, too. I can just, like, go through enemies and also tie them up without taking any damage. It's probably a big April Fool's Day for the pirates. I see. Some sort of prank. No. No. Oh, he just picked up his rock and threw it back at him. Eat. that sign? Let's see. Tropos this way. Okay. Ha! 
I remember you things being annoying as fuck. Not anymore. All of a sudden we have tons of coinage. Ha! <laughs> I just like the idea of it just plunking off in there. Yeah, this guy's abilities are pretty awesome, to be honest. Hmm. Seen a lot of these chests that just require me to kill all the enemies, which is a bit different. More tropos this way? Yep, more tropos this way. Bring me that fruit so I might eat it. And that one. And that one. Reminds me of my authority figure uh, playthrough of Void Bastards, where I don't have to go and pick up things. Someone's asking for help. Help, help, please, anyone. Okay. Perfect. Wow. You totally saved me. Thanks, buds. I thought those bees were going to stop me, even though they don't have any feet, and kick me, even though they don't have any feet. And chew on my eyeballs. They're probably capable of that. But they didn't. Thanks to you, guy. I was just making my merry way back to Buccaneries. When those monsters jumped down and said, Hey, we're gonna cut you. Now it's like, Ah! But then, you guys came along. Yep. Say, I'm going to rejoin my brothers outside Buccaneries. Come and visit us, why don't you? See you there. That was a very weird little fella. Indeed. Quiet. Ah, here we go. We get to use our ability to get through the water. More water. What's down here? More water. Alright, let's not go to Tropos just yet. Let's see what's on the other side of this. Nice. Step on it. Fuck it, I'll do it myself. <laughs> Anything else down here? Not really. Steamy. Oh, there's a thing up there. Hmm. It's kind of weird the way this is working, actually. Because you kind of instantly drop him. God damn it. As soon as the water hits you, you fucking just fall out of the air. Okay, there's nothing up here. Well, I'm glad I came up here to get disappointed. We're back in Dropos. All right, fellas. We can get down to Dropos over there. Mm-hmm. So... Your brother mentioned a waterfall in Tropos. To find the pirate base, we should look around there. With Otis's wings and my webs, we'll find it in no time. So leave it to us, Slowpoke. I mean, are you any, like, faster than he is? I think we got all this stuff. Or at least most of this stuff. Oh. Idiot.
Oh, what? That thing can't be lit? Oh, well. Whatever. Now, here's a question. Can I pull that out from the other side? No. Worth a try. Now, let's go see Buccaneary. Buds! We're all here! Sure are! Let's have some fun! Bah! Well, what should we do? Oh. I know! Let's go to... The Cannon! Yeah! Let's roll! Oof. Hey! Well, up, guy? So, they're going to the cannon back in Belly? Is that what I'm hearing? Those critters are adorable. Seems to be the consensus. Welcome! Let's sell up that booty. You've collected 1,657 Buccaneary coins. Well, look at you, Mr. Adventurer. Bringing in Buccaneary coins from high and low. I bet you're pretty famous by now, eh? Well, I have something for you. Here, have this. Okay, little one. Like we've rehearsed a billion times now. Just... Eh. I swear, that little cretin will be the life of me one day. Just... On it, ma'am. For, for you, sir. <laughs> it's my very last brew. You'll miss that taste, Jam. You're a real owl man now, I'd reckon. Alright, neat. How much do we need for this? 1,500? We can get this one, too. You've collected 657 Buccaneary coins. Hop! Stick em up! <laughs> Look at that sprite. We don't see that one too often. I think this is the first time. I've got a gun! No, you've got a gun, have you? Well, I've also got a gun. Oh, my word. I don't need it anymore. Here you go. Very good. I feel safe. Of course you do. Now, back to your... I like it when they behave. Collect 1,750 Buccaneary coins for another surprise. Okay. A scope that attaches to the gun increases the range of Getty's pistol, even though he'll never be in the group again, Wink. The next thing we get is, like, mysterious and shit. He's enti or she's entirely too interested in booty. Can anyone truly be too interested in booty? Alright, let's head back to Valley. That should be down here. Haven't been back here in a while. How y'all doing? You're still super sad, I understand. Actually, I don't see uh, Strix out here. Hmm. Some distressed fellow went by here. He had the same uniform as the city guards. A friend of yours? I hope that you two figure it out. Friendships can be tricky things. Are you talking about Azio? We need to evacuate this shoddy little town at once. All of this talk about rebuilding is nonsense. We need to get as far away from the pirates as we can. Okay. Hey, Otis. Um... Getty dropped by and picked up... Oh, yeah, that's right. Getty ran back here, too. So that's probably who they're talking about. Need to figure out how Azio's doing, too. Anyway, Getty dropped by and picked up his things, but then he left. Are... Are you two, well, okay? Why is it getting so dark? Forgot that there's time outside uh, our regular places. He seemed to be really angry about something. 
I'm sure whatever happened, you did the right thing. Oh, she believes in us. We all know that you always mean well, Otis. Well, that's good. Bongo Man! Yeti didn't look happy when he drove by Otis. Hope you didn't do something bad. Friends are important. Don't lose them. Okay. Uh, your friend ran off, huh? Well, I don't know... I don't know either of you too well, but maybe it's for the best, you know? I mean, most people are pretty annoying. <laughs> Now you can get some peace. It's an interesting take on the whole situation. Thanks for those reassuring words. Here's the cannon. I wonder what the pirates are up to now. I hope they'll just leave us alone. They won't. They have some sort of like, I don't know, directive to fucking kill everything or something. Hey, you're looking for Giddy, huh? Sometimes we get have to give some people some time. Okay. We have to do what we can, Otis. We have to calm down and do what we can. Mm -hmm. Let's see what's going on at the lab. Oh, there's some stuff around. This appears to be quite new. Hmm, I'm nearly done with this building. You don't see what's different about it, do you? Actually, I do see a lot. The art isn't always easily visible. What are you fucking talking about? <laughs> I can't enter the building. <laughs> Just S-ing, <laughs> SMH. Hey, there's Effie. Money well spent on the buccanary stuff. Well, there's no one in here. That's good. It's like and Getty might actually be over here. He's probably at the graveyard. Being super sad. I can understand that. Oh, the unbreakable boxes. We'll find that son of a bitch. I somewhat remember you. Hey, bro. Where's Big Bro? Did you annoy him until he left? Don't worry, Bro. I do that to my mom all the time. Uh huh. <laughs> it's the best. <laughs> Great. <laughs> that child with the giant red scissors. What could what could she be about? The pirates didn't come here to destroy Veli. That's for sure. The only thing they destroyed was this ruin. The owls used to make all kinds of stuff so advanced I can't comprehend it. Whatever was in here, it was important enough that they prioritized coming here over Advent. I think you're saying the same thing from last time. Well, there's some more rings we haven't gotten. Ah! Could have gotten this eons ago. Scissor Man from Clock Tower. Hmm. The red scissors remind me of, uh... What was that? Kill or Kill or whatever? That animu? That had red scissors in it? Thankfully, she's not dressed like those characters. Alright. I can't summon my buddies right now, so I can't actually get through that. Hmm. That's unfortunate. I can't get through that. Well, I guess we're done here. I went to the cannon, and they weren't at the cannon. So I don't know where those little buggers went off to. I mean, this is the only cannon I can think of. Oh, yeah, we talked to you. All right, Getty, you want to be a dick? You can be a dick. Let's go see Azio real quick, though. I think he's over here. 
Or this is the ruin. No, this is definitely where Azio is. How you doing, buddy? Leave me, Otis. I don't want to see you here again. Listen. It's time for you to stop being a bitch. There's important things going on. You can't just stand out here on this precipice until the end of fucking days. People are depending on you. And who knows where the fuck Strix has gone off to. Alright. Okay, I can bring back my buddies now. I'm sure he'll be back. If I remember correctly, the place we want to go is over here. Not exactly there. Have we been in there? Let's see real quick. We'll just leave you there for a moment. Oh yes, we have a coin place. But we have no coin to put in there. Very unfortunate. I like how you stayed on that screen, by the way. It increases my immersion. Well, hey there, Bonanza. Looking for someone? Let me give you some advice. Just jump around absolutely everywhere super fast. Then you'll find them eventually. I see. <laughs> Makes thinking emoji face. Your friend left. Well, I re yeah, I remember him. Getty, right? I trained with him many years ago. He was never the best soldier, but he had a good attitude. That's probably why he was sent to the idyllic place like Belly. He'll come back to you soon enough. He's not the type to brood forever, like Azio. Who I also know from training, wink. Okay, well, I'm glad that everyone's supportive of us. Alright, so this is the path of progress. I guess we're in the pirate base already, my goodness. You're gonna make this much easier, aren't you? Oh my goodness! Yeah, he's actually a pretty good combatant. Oh, what? Ha! Even if you try to do it stealthily. Oh, goodness. Not a big deal. Yeah, I'm really digging Twig's, like, gameplay dynamics. Hmm. Boxes. Come here. I have a feeling there's something under these. Not that one, but maybe the next one. Maybe that's why you're here. No? Okay. Figured I'd try. I do like the design of the ships. You can see this thing just kind of moored here with its big old wooden legs. I guess we'll go into this ship. Nothing bad has happened when we've entered these ships in the past. Certainly not, you know, advent getting destroyed or anything similar. Hmm, the ship appears to be in complete lockdown. Our, me our mechanic companion might have made short work of these doors. Like every other door, right? But since he is missing, we'll have to find another way. Well, maybe that man-sized vent directly above me would be the, you know, path of progress. Come now, my friend. No, don't worry yourself. I'm sure Giddy is all right. Yeah, he's gotten him, or he's gotten himself eaten. Hey, <laughs> certainly not. I have the utmost faith in our green comrade. He and a Luigi. He's probably back in Belly already, safe and sound, even though we didn't see him there and we looked up the bottom. Meanwhile, leave this one to me. I might not be able to open this door, 
but we shall find the oak opening mechanism. We should look around somewhere. The man-sized vent was, in fact, the path to progress. We're going to look over there first. Reminds me a bit of Chrono Trigger. And I think there's also a segment in uh, Secret of Evermore, much like this. It's nice just the enemies light up so you can see them. Nothing, huh? Disappointing. The uh, here we are. Uh -huh. We find a lever in there. We I can open the door for you. I will need to stay here to keep it open. Wow, he actually fits in there. Voila! Go ahead, Otis. I'll meet you on the other side. Make sure there's no treasure chest or anything in here. Oh. Intruders? Prepare for annihilation. Hi there, friend. We're here to see our, my buddy, Dirk. Step aside. Oh, um, I see something we can actually target. I, I saw it on the reticle at the top left there. Whoa, that was harsh. Artist, let's teach this tin can a lesson. Am I supposed to do something of this? Or am I just supposed to leave? Guess I'll just leave. Where'd they go up to? Fine, I'll just smoke you out! Oh. Of course we just have a cannon that shoots fucking toxic gas. Cause why the fuck wouldn't we have something like that? Oh, I'm... Oh. Okay, just forget about health. Just fucking get out of here as quickly as possible. There we go. <laughs> He's just hanging out in there. Because <laughs> I dropped him there. <laughs> Why is there a button for the cannon in the vents? Why? Why does it exist here? <laughs> oh, shit. Well, I got through there with actually very minimal damage. Okay, now what? We're gonna have to find another mechanism in there. Maybe I need to leave some of someone up on the button. Cause I can't really do that. Ah, there's more down here, of course. How silly of me to overlook such things. And back in the dark. I mean, you don't have vent-operated cannons in your home, Lethal? Well, I mean, I do, but I thought they were sort of, like, unique. I don't know why I had them installed, to be honest. There's something else up here? I notice I can go up further. Oh, that one, that one's red. Oh, okay. I must not have the right key card to get in there. And back into the dark vents. Going to destroy you. Anything over here? Nope. The relics have been secured. We'll prep for takeoff. And we'll prep for takeoff. Good. 
plot a course towards the remaining settlements. And what of the owl boy? Boy. <laughs> he comes and goes as he pleases. Regardless, he serves no purpose now. I will return to my quarters. Do not fail me. As always, Captain. The captain doesn't consider him a threat. Good. I'll take care of your treachery soon enough. Alphonse. And then he skitters off into the distance. Wasn't sure if that guy was going to turn around. So I'm glad I waited. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I almost fell down after that. <laughs> Alright, another door. Of infinite possibility. Nothing bad happened. Oh. More vent switches for reasons. Let me guess, this is a timer thing? Maybe it isn't. Yep. Lethal is so, so good at video games, he knows what's gonna happen before it even gets there. Oh. Fuck. Oh fuck, we have more of this stupid shit? Are you fucking kidding me with this? Drop it! Oops. Okay, so we just have switches everywhere for this. Also, holy fuck my health. Thought you were going to progress in my direction. Huh. I guess I was just so good before that I didn't notice that, huh? Oh, don't do it. Oh, okay, so they just... It's fucking bullshit game. <sighs> okay. Uh, no. <laughs> How did you see me? There's nothing to be seen. Okay, well this door is locked, so we're not getting through here. Okay. Do I need to go back up into the ceiling again? Maybe I do. Ah, oh, this dark shit. Was there something beyond the button? Oh, there is. How do people get around this fucking ship? Are they fucking doing this too? I can only imagine that they are. Okay, what kind of significance does he have? What's this about, then? A 
Okay. <laughs> that makes about as much sense as anything. You know, I like this game, but some things about it are just fucking befuddling. Like, what am I seeing here? I'm not sure if I'll need a second one of you, but... Oh, I see. It needs two now. The first one only needed one. Oh, now I'm just gonna fucking die. So that's good. Yep, just gonna fucking die. That's good. I'm glad everything's setting off the alarm now. Like before, they established that they wouldn't do that. Where the hell am I? Okay, so I actually made it to a checkpoint. <laughs> All part of my cunning scheme, you see, to get uh, to get full health again. So if I had just gotten in here, I could have pressed the button. You know what? That's fine. Of course, these things do not set off the alarm. Because of course they don't. What the fuck is this place? Why are these things in the vent? <laughs> Seems like a terrible place to keep things that fucking explode. What do I know though, right? I'm not sure what the fuck that did. If it did anything, it probably turns off the gas again. Okay, another thing we can lift up. Let me do some forward scouting now. Okay, so maybe that opens... I'm not exactly sure. Let's see. Not you. Get out of here. I should get out of here. Hmm. Where the hell am I even going with this? Ah, I see. That's cool, actually. I like that. Alright, what the fuck does this open? You're not going to show me again. That's really unfortunate. Okay, it's just this one down here. This is where the captain was only moments ago. Certainly looks like a boss room type area as I press the forward button. <laughs> ah, what is happening? Oh my goodness! Is that a moon in the background? Oh no! I... I think the ship is leaving ground! It would seem so. There's no telling where we're going to end up! What if they're hanging the valley? We need to find Alphonson fast! Can't we just teleport his ass back here? Oh, what the fuck ever. Okay, so there's a down way. Let's see what's up. Oh. Up leads the progress, it would seem. Oh, we're stuck. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess we'll... I guess we'll go down here then. Ha! <laughs> I was like, I want to see what's up. It's like, down. Let's see. Can you, like, sicky that thing down? There we go. That's another door underneath me. Hmm. A door of infinite mystery? What could it mean? Let's see what time we got here. Alright, this is the time. Alright, folks. So, apparently we have been separated from Alphonse. I don't want to be in this dark area for the end of this. 
We've been separated from Alphonse. The ship is going who knows fucking where. It could be going to the valley. It could be going to some other place. We'll find out next time together as a family. I'll see you then.